Many people I know are leaving Seattle, Washington area and moving to the Phoenix, Arizona areas. Washington and Arizona have huge differences and I always scratch my head wondering why they are leaving. So I'm going to go over the seven differences between living in Washington and living in Arizona from my experience. Hi, I'm Karen Jackson and I'm a realtor in the greater Seattle area and I've lived in Washington my entire life. And I love it here, but I also do have a house in Arizona. Be sure to click the subscribe button so you can see all my upcoming videos. The most obvious reason is there is so much more sun in Arizona. Seattle gets a bit sun deprived, especially December to February. Have you ever thought about being a snowbird? If so, put a like below. I'd love to see how many people are thinking about it. Washington has all four seasons. You get the rain and the snow in the winter. You get pretty flowers and April showers. In the spring, you get sunny, mild temperatures. And in the summer, you get 70s to 90s, an extremely beautiful fall full of autumn colors. In Arizona, besides the temperature difference, it looks about the same most of the year. In the spring though, you do see many cacti blooming, which is really beautiful. The weather is so different. There's more sun and heat in Arizona, but Washington's weather is milder and much grayer. In Washington, you can be outside year round if you bundle up. In Arizona, you have to hide from the heat. It is near the 100 plus mark between mid-May and September, and in June and July, it doesn't even get below 100, it seems. But the winters are wonderful in Arizona. It's a great escape from Washington. In Arizona, you can count on the sun most days, and in Washington, you get a little bit of everything many days. Clouds, drizzle, sun breaks. It's very difficult for the weather forecasters to predict the weather here. In fact, some say we get winter, spring, summer, and fall all in one day sometimes. Many people are leaving Seattle to go towards the Phoenix area because the cost of living is much lower. The cost of living is much lower in Phoenix than it is in Seattle. Based on a national average of 100, Seattle is 167 and Phoenix is 108. The housing taxes and sales taxes are higher and the liquor tax is much higher here in Washington. But Arizona has a state income tax, and in Washington, we do not. Food and gas used to be a lot less expensive in Arizona, but in my recent travels there, there was not as much of a gap, but it definitely is lower in Arizona. Utility bills are higher in Washington, but Arizona uses much more electricity because they need air conditioning most of the year. Housing is definitely less expensive in Phoenix versus Seattle. I would say that purchasing a house in Arizona is close to half the cost of Seattle. But if you're purchasing for investment purposes, Seattle has a much higher appreciation. The reason people are leaving Seattle is the politics are much more liberal than Arizona. The driving, in my opinion, the driving in Arizona is much crazier than Washington. Ever I go to Arizona, I have to prepare myself for Arizona driving. Both Arizona and Washington have lots of traffic in the big city areas. Both cities are melting pots, so there are all different driving skills. There are more lanes on the freeway in Arizona and people are driving 80 plus normally. Seattle is more congested and the freeways are not designed as well for traffic. The scenery is much different in Arizona versus Washington. Arizona is mostly desert. They do have some mountains and lakes and farmland. Washington has a little bit of everything, forests, farmlands, desert, water everywhere. Everywhere in Arizona is very sand color with beautiful blue skies and palm trees. On the best days in Washington, you're seeing beautiful blue skies with evergreen trees and water in the background, or you're seeing gray drizzly skies. Both Arizona and Washington have great outdoor areas for hiking, there's lakes, boating. Washington definitely has more water, rivers, streams, oceans, and lakes and more mountains and skiing. Arizona has more senior living and over 55 communities. There's many snowbirds. People migrate to Arizona for the winters and most people don't come to Washington for the winters. House styles are very different. There are more rambler or ranch style one stories in Arizona than you see in Seattle. This is due to the population age and land availability. Houses in Arizona tend to have more tile and have stucco siding or cinder block. Washington has more vinyl floors and carpet and wood or hardy plank siding. Washington seems to have more variety in scenery. 
Much of Arizona is brown and stucco and looks similar. It's sometimes hard to tell if you're in a different city or not. Each of the cities in Washington are very different with very different shapes and styles. Both Arizona and Washington are great states to live in and visit. The good thing is, it is just a short two and a half hour flight between them.